Hi everyone, thank you for watching. Today we're opening up the August Ipsy Glam Bag. So I think this by far is uh, my favorite beauty subscription, or at least what I would recommend the most. It is $12, you get five items every single month, and oftentimes you get like one, maybe even two full-size items, and I think it is a great deal, and along with that, you get a bag. So I will link Ipsy down below if you're interested in subscribing. So in today's video, we're going to be doing an unboxing. I will insert clips of me trying some of the items, uh, and like usual, our new thing, we will talk about one way to get use out of your Ipsy bags because I don't know if you're like me but if you've been subscribed for a while you really do accumulate those cute bags uh, so now I'm taking comments from you guys every week and featuring them in our videos uh, and then the last thing we'll do in the video today is review the products quickly from last month before we get started I just want to take a quick moment to say hi and welcome if you are new here my name is Kitty I open subscription boxes every single day here in our channel so if you love beauty boxes and subscription boxes as much as I do I would absolutely love it if you subscribe that would mean so much to me I actually plan on filming a big giveaway video later tonight so uh, definitely make sure you have your notifications on so you don't miss that or any other future uploads but let's get started how about we quickly go over our ipsy bag use recommendation of the month and this month I pulled a comment from Trey Marie and she says uh, for Ipsy bags, I don't know if anyone has thought of it, but use the bags for party favors at like birthday parties, etc. I can see I can see putting cute little things and treats in it for guests to take home. I think that's a great idea. And also reading this comment today just kind of made me like happy and hopeful for the future. I know a lot of us can't really have like parties, maybe like with our immediate family, but you know, I've <laughs> been really down lately. I'm sure a lot of people are, so I think it's good to like you know, stay positive, look forward to the future, because one day, one day it will be better. It will be normal or more normal than it is now. So I think that is a great idea. And I don't know about you, but I can't wait to have a party and I will gladly give out cute little gifts. I have enough makeup, enough Ipsy bags. Uh, so thank you, Trey Marie, so much for your comment. Uh, and if you guys have any ideas, please leave a comment down below uh, for possibly being featured in an upcoming video. Even if you aren't featured, it definitely helps everyone watching this video out now, so reading the comments. They can you know, take your ideas into consideration. So thank you in advance. But now let's get to the actual Ipsy bag. So it's like holographic and shiny this month. There's a little zipper circle that says Ipsy on it. Sneak peek inside. So there's a card, but Ipsy just does not list the products anymore. I would be shocked if it does inside here. No. <laughs> so the theme for August for all the Ipsy bags is the future is yours. Look forward to a bright and shiny tomorrow from achieving your glowy skin goals to discovering what lights you up inside and out. A whole new world of beauty value, valued at 50 or more dollars is in your hands. Where will you begin? And then on the inside it talks about three next level ingredients to try. Oh, I'll read that later. So this month it doesn't look like we have any full size items. So with Ipsy, uh, with the regular bag you get to customize one item and I was really excited when I chose my choice because I've been wanting to try this so bad. So let's start with this. It is the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. So there's a little guy here. And this has such a fine mist. I'll insert a clip of me using this. I'm afraid I'm gonna go through this so fast. So the mist is really fine. So I just like kept spraying it on my face. I have a problem with saying sprays. I use a lot. I just like to, I don't know. I feel like it really melts in my powder and stuff. But this stuff really does leave your skin looking dewy. And if you like that effect, I think this is great. Uh, everyone that's been raging about this for a while, they're right. I like a dewy look. Uh, and I mean, I normally just achieve it naturally by sweating, but I think this is great. It definitely melts it in my powders and everything. I look dewy. Love it. I wish it was a little bigger because I feel like I will go through it like I said already, super fast. There's five milliliters or 0.17 fluid ounces. Uh, but it's really nice that I got to try this because I think it is pretty pricey. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna keep using it, of course. This is just first impressions, but if I continue to keep liking it, I may have to purchase it, especially if there's like a sale. I think there's a sale going on in Sephora right now, but 
I'm not gonna know by besides subscriptions, but one day, one day maybe I'll be able to afford it. Uh, but let's move on. There's only one other item I tried today and it was a lip gloss. I'm probably due for reapplication, but this is by Real Her. It's the Be Limitless Color Rich Lip Gloss. And, or Be Limitless is a shade and then it says mauve. So it is a mauve lip gloss. It's really comfortable. I'm gonna put some more on right now. I just filmed a long video before this and I took some sips of water but still left some color on my lips, which I like. And I really like this color a lot. Yeah, so it's not like fully opaque, but it definitely has good color payoff. And like I was just saying, even after talking a lot and having some sips of water, like the glossy part of it seemed to be gone. Like I couldn't feel it anymore, but some color stuck around. So I love that. And yeah, I have a feeling I will definitely go through this. I am happy to have it. Now the last three items I did not try, but this one I'm super excited to get. It's a pretty new release, I believe. This is by Briogeo, the Be Gentle, Be Kind, Avocado and Kiwi Mega Moisture Superfood Mask. It's gotta be the new one, because I know their newest mask, at least that I can recall, unless they came out with another one. I swear this was just weeks ago, was avocado. I can't forget avocado. I love avocado so much. Uh, and now I get to have some in my hair. But I've heard good things about this. It says, Superfood Mask is a thirst quenching mask that hydrates dry, parched hair. Rescue your hair with green smoothie inspired ingredients like spinach leaf extract, chia seeds, and cocoa seed butter that are loaded with phytonutrients to help restore, maintain, and lock in moisture. So you just use it like a normal hair mask. You leave it in for five to 10 minutes. You get a decent amount in here. It's not just an itty bitty sample. You get a fluid ounce or 30 milliliters. I do have pretty long hair, but I know I'll get at least a few uses out of this. I like to use hair masks as my conditioning treatment when I shower or when I wash my hair because um, I only wash my hair like every three to five days, something. I don't, I don't know. I lose track of days now, but whenever I notice it looking like noticeably greasy and dirty. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to try this out. Next, I've tried this a long time ago. I believe I received it in a birch box, or no, I'm like 99.9% .9 positive, and I liked it. This is by Balance Me, it's their Congested Skin Serum. I think they changed their labeling a little bit, but this is like a natural like, acne spot treatment, and you get seven milliliters in here, but since this is a spot treatment, it lasts a long time. On the back it says, our on-the-spot soothing gel was created to gently calm inflammation and speed away blemishes without causing dryness or irritation. And that is great. And I, like I said, I've used it before, and that is true. A lot of acne spot treatments can be very drying, so the fact that this doesn't do that is amazing. Uh, and it helps with the inflammation, which whenever I get bad blemishes, it gets really red and inflamed, so I am happy to have this back in my skincare collection. And the last item in the Ipsy bag is by Naked Cosmetics, and it is a lip scrub, and this is in vanilla cream. So, kind of small, but honestly, I'm glad to get this size. I have a lip scrub right now, and I feel like this has happened with every lip scrub I've had. They're kind of big, and the sugar in it, like, the scrub itself kind of, like, dries out before it's done, and it's, like, uncomfortable, uncomfortable to use, and you can't really dig it out. Uh, so I think it's better to have a smaller size like this. I want to smell it. I don't use a lip scrub probably as often as I should. Usually, like, if I exfoliate my face, I would do it, but I've kind of gotten away from physical exfoliants and just use, like, chemical exfoliants like AJs and stuff. Um, but this is a reminder now that I should do that, especially if I'm going to start wearing liquid lipsticks more. Like, right now, the gloss, I don't really care. There's a safety seal. It smells just like vanilla. If you want to know, that's what it looks like. I want to feel it. It doesn't look like... Oh, it's like a lot softer and more emollient than the lip scrubs I have that are just like pure sugar, it seems like. So this seems like moisturizing as well. Oh, I'm even more excited to try it now. So yeah, that is everything, you guys. So not my like all-time favorite Ipsy, but I'm definitely happy with it. I'm so happy I finally got to try the Tatcha Dewy Skin Mist. I'm really loving this lip gloss. I feel like it's my favorite, like, ideal, like, color, like, go-to color. And a newer product that's great to try, too. And Briogeo is an expensive hair brand, and everyone on YouTube raves about it, so happy to have that. Like I said, happy of this. I'm even happy to have a lip scrub. Normally these wouldn't excite me. So yeah, overall good month. You guys have to let me know if you get Ipsy what you got in your bag. Are we bag twins? Uh, are you happy with your bag? Definitely leave a comment down below. But now let's talk about the July bag. So I have it somewhere in front of me. 
So I thought last month was pretty good. So I would say we received like one full size item last month because we received a brush. I'm pretty sure it was this one. Um, this is SL Miss Glam brush. I can't really read my writing when I was like doing research for like my beauty ranking video, which I still need to film. Stay tuned. Uh, I'm hoping to do that tonight as well. I'm so ambitious. I'm like, I'm gonna film all the videos tonight, but. <laughs> uh, so yeah, like this, you could tell. It's dirty. I like getting blending brushes because I use these the most. Like packing brushes I use, but like lately I've been using my finger. I used to be like anti-finger for eyeshadow, but I'm kind of digging it now. Uh, my favorite item, I didn't expect it to be my favorite, was a body lotion. It's like almost out. Uh, this is by Hemp's and it's their Citrine Crystal and Quartz Herbal Body Moisturizer. This is about Positive Body and Soul. I've heard so many people rave about Hemp's for so long, but I'm like, why is this a body lotion? I have like seriously so many body lotions. And then when I got this one, like it smells amazing, but there's glitter in it. But it's like very like light glitter. Um, I put some in my hand and I was like, I don't want to be all glittery, but you guys, this smells so good. I was trying to get more out after I showered. I have it to store it upside down. Oh, it smells so good. And you guys keep telling me that all their scents smell amazing and not all of them have glitter. I, it just sucks. I have so many body lotions. I, I cannot, I should not buy any body lotions, but if I ever run out of body lotion, which I don't know if I ever will because I seriously have like this huge thing. I just give them all away so I can buy this. Oh, it smells so good. It's almost gone and I'm gonna be sad when it is. One thing I don't have in front of me because that is actually in a box for the 10,000 subscriber giveaway and it is a Naked Cosmetics Loose Shadow. So one of you will be receiving that in the future. And then the item I chose last month was the It Cosmetics Brow Power. So this is like their universal taupe. Uh, so it's like depending on how much pressure you use, it can be like light to dark. And I've used this in the past, like distant past, and I liked it and I wanted to try it again. And I like that it has a spoolie on one end, even though it's not full size, you still get a decent amount of product in here. And I do like this. Um, I do like my Winky Lux uh, brow pencil that I received in last, uh, was it the last one? I don't know, in FabFitFun. I've been using that. I have used this a few days and I do like it. They're not that different, but yeah, the Winky Lux brow, unibrow pencil it was called is just my go-to. I love it, but I'm happy to have this too. And then last thing was like a serum and this is just okay. This is by REP. It's Real Elemental Practice Phytocell Moisture Sika All-in-One Serum. So this is good for like um, helping restore your skin barrier, like if you're irritated or anything like that. So I use this, there's like half gone, but I would use this on uh, nights um, when I needed that, like if I used an AHA or something like that. Like it wasn't a part of my everyday um, skincare. I kind of switch up my serums based on what my skin seems to need. So uh, I will use this. Nothing's wrong with it. My skin agree with it just fine. Uh, I just don't have overly sensitive skin normally, so yeah, I'll just save it for when I do. So that is everything, you guys. So I thought last month was good. This month is good. I think I like this month even better, but I'll keep playing with everything and let you know last month. So thank you guys so much for being here and unboxing or unbagging with me. And thanks again to Trey Marie for your comment. And thank you in advance to everyone who's gonna leave a comment down below. You guys are the best. I love our community here. Thank you to our channel members. Your support means so much. If you guys are interested in becoming a channel member, there is a link in the description box always, or like down right by it says like subscribe and the notification bell. There's a little thing that says join. If you click that, you won't be automatically joined or anything like that, but it will let you know the perks. Like one perk is having live streams. Uh, so definitely uh, so do that if you are interested. We do little giveaways, we chat, it's fun, but no pressure. Just you being here watching really helps me out and I appreciate it so much. So thank you and stay safe, stay healthy. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.